I have a lot of the, the coaching staff. District champion, uh, picture 1987. Dennis Hart spent 33 years at North Mesquite High School, and through it all, he's been surrounded by Skeeters. Katie went over to North Mesquite to have her picture made with her daddy. His daughters both went to Mesquite. Both currently work at the high school. North Mesquite Mesquite Week was hard it for was us. very hard. And both are married to Skeeters football coaches. Having to come back from San Antonio, he was he was willing for me to coach anywhere if it meant bringing his daughter back. And, and I told Jeff this not too long ago. I said, Jeff, you still got to know that I bleed blue. But Dennis's number one loyalty has always been to the health and well-being of student athletes. And athletic trainers are the front line of athletic health care especially in the secondary schools. The neat thing for us was when our dad would run on the field, you know, the f stadium would go quiet and players would take a knee and it just seemed like it was out of reverence for our dad and because he was kind of a big deal. And now looking back, we realize it was because of the injured player. I'm glad we hired an athletic trainer. You can't tell Dennis Hart's story without Bucky Taylor, his counterpart at Mesquite High School. We talked everything from pro sports to politics to uh, things that impact our, our health care jobs. Bucky is yet another Skeeter. He's also Dennis's best friend. Bucky's like a brother to me. And back in the day, that time, Mesquite, North Mesquite was like the Hatfields and McCoys. Thank you. <laughs> it kind of shows the character that we have to realize that we, we needed each other. He was me and I was him. When people on each side of town are administrators, they would know that that we were in the business of health care for all athletes, not just uh, our own particular school or feeder system. I saw their friendship up close. We all worked together on House Bill 2038 and Natasha's Law, which gave student athletes certain protections when they had a concussion. That wasn't the hard part. The hard part was taking it and implementing the law into practice in the uh, 1,200 high school, public high schools in the state of Texas. They had so much passion, and they were so driven to get this law passed. And one thing they kept repeating was just about helping people and helping the future. Dennis has won several awards for his work in the field of athletic training. He chaired the founding committee of the Texas State Athletic Trainers Association and was an inaugural member of its Hall of Honor. Well, the most important thing about Dennis is that he's a wonderful person who happens to be a great athletic trainer. There are certain people you want in your life that are difference makers, and Dennis Hart is that person. It was just decades of his service to North Mesquite High School and the North Mesquite community and everything that he stood for and all the kids that he helped and took care of and coaches and coaches' families and his value to North Mesquite High School is just legendary. Everyone used to always ask me, said, well, you know, why did you always stay at North Mesquite all those years? And, and uh, my answer was, that's the best job that I was ever offered.